welcome to, or welcome back to, No Delivery. Now, it's going to be a little weird. Um, maybe things will look different, maybe things will sound different. I'm on my brand new computer, and of course, one of the fir very first games I actually record, and of course, dead tired, is No Delivery. You know, an RPG Maker game on a 12-core, 24-thread PC with 1080 Ti. Uh, insert memes here uh, of playing, getting an uber powerful computer, and then playing games with the visuals of something from the 90s. Uh, but either way, let's get into it. I just wanted to do something simple so I can test a lot of things. Uh, I didn't bring, unfortunately, I completely forgot to bring my Audacity settings of like what was my saved settings, what would I have used to. Uh, recalibrate my microphone audio and Sony Vegas I had to re-download and whatever settings it has of you know 1080 nice quality it's out the window so yeah we have to redo all that so I'm just gonna do this one video as a sample easy see how long it takes to render see if my computer's a workstation and sexy now like it work you know sexy at rendering videos who knows Let's just get into the game. Um, and thankfully, every save file for all my games are also here. And the same for Darkest Dungeon. So whenever I actually decide to stream that next, which one is definitely on Saturday, but I don't know if I'm going to do maybe one on Friday, Friday evening? We'll just have to see. Now what the fuck was I doing? We defeated the trash boss. And then I got the alleyway gate key. I guess we can check out the alley gate key. One thing I'm obviously hoping is, as I'm playing this, also, how's my health? Fine. As I'm playing this, and also we're going to have to check all of you see the, the gifts. Since, like this one, two brooms. Because uh, I had done it for a bunch of them, like the one down here, uh, that there was multiple things in this gift box, but a lot of people were telling me that I missed some. Mm and other gift boxes that I didn't dig more than once. So, let's do that. And then we'll go outside and see what leads to the, I'm presuming the front, the front of the, uh, front of the establishment? That's what the gate key, I think, went, uh, went before. Yes. More brooms. I, I guess that's okay. And that clown is still there. Some people told me that the game is actually 8 hours of gameplay. If that's actually true as well, this game is gonna probably take me like maybe 24 hours instead. Alright, let's see. Unlocked. Trash. Excellent, now we can just exit and enter from there. It's a personal... Oh, there we go. Mmm. <laughs> Unload. It's required that. Yeah, blah, 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 blah. Unload. Get up close and fire shots at point blank range. Hits hard, unlikely to miss, but wastes ammo. I mean, it sounds good. If I have eight ammo, I might as well try it, I guess. Dungeon? No. Locked. Uh, yeah, I don't trust it. I don't trust this either. Okay, I, I like it now. Why is the brooms? A weathered pedestal? Whatever was here before used to greet customers as they entered. Do I have anything I could maybe put on it? Trash? Disposable. Whoops. Wait, I can... Weird. I don't think I can actually use cameras outside of a fight. Weird. Ah, I, I don't know. Probably for something later. But I think for now, we have enough brooms. And pizza. And money. I guess... We can just go to the managers and let's do a dungeon. Why not? We need to get the Butterfinger thing. Mm. 
The arcade was, ah, uh, no wait, jeez, yeah, or for the arcade freezer, paper face. Alleys we completed, so we don't need to do it again, and playground, folding stool. Ah, eh, cheese bar, whatever. All of them, uh, I'll be doing it all of them inevitably, but one thing at a time. Oh, hey. Hey, fancy meeting you here. I actually just some found some goodies down here. They still seem fresh. Sure. Oh, shit. What? Huh. It seems... Wait. Oh, yeah. Um, this is rather cheap, really. Um, fuck it. Just load up, man. See you around, or not. Thank you, Elmo. Oh. Hello, robot. Free health. No worries, we're competent. It's a little bit over uh, overpowered, though, if you ask me. But, yeah, I mean... What? What? A mess of tendrils? It's just like, it's, it's just wires. Eh, okay. Let's try. Dangling tendrils. I like. We're gonna have to save that for a boss. One. Oh. Not that, but no, no, not that. Easy. Ticket. Oh. Alright, that's, that's another way you could have gotten tickets instead of me just playing that boring Pac Man game repeatedly. I'm wondering if there's a, an actual purpose, perhaps, to fixing those machines besides waste broom to get HP. I'm curious if it has any story purpose. You? Yes, you. Oh, one's actually talking to me for once. What? The machine calls to you, literally. Hello there. You are an employee. Let me test your... Liability. Sure. So professional. <laughs> Talking cabinet took negative 10 HP. Oh. I'm sorry that I, I mean, already sort of won the fight, I guess. <laughs> what? Should I talk to it? I'm confused. Is it... Back to work? That was weird. Okay. Alright, finally at the boss. I did a lot of skipping, because... I don't know, it's enemies you've all seen before, so it's just let's get to the boss and... Decide to play one more game. Can you see me? The way I see you. Ah, I remember this boss. I need to know... Well... No, no further. Hmm. Hmm, that's a lot of health. I gotta get rid of these other dudes. Taser. Bam! Oh. Oh. Okay, this is not a good... I didn't even get a second person. I think I remember someone saying if I don't get a, a teammate just to run. Which means this is... Eh, this is not good. Um, disposable camera. I don't have a lot of cameras too, so this isn't gonna help, but I need food ASAP. I'm gonna just have to keep using it while I heal. Oh, 
Oh, jeez. All right, let's see. Um, one more pizza. I don't know if I'm gonna win this fight, especially since the enemies surrounding him can fucking stun me, which is uh, kind of a bitch. I will say. Come on, just don't miss. Thank God. Alright, uh, stun. No missing, please. Nice. Not nice. Fucking serious. There, okay. Teaser. There we go. Ah, oh, come on. Uh, fuck, I don't know. If he attacks me twice, I'm basically fucked. Yeah, I feel like I'm fucked, but... Taser. Fuck. Motherfucker, seriously. <sighs> Especially when I use so much money and I'm gonna have to get someone else. Wait, look at the... At the body of an employee convulsing on the floor, the lights around them making it impossible to see the horrific look on their face. Is this if they were seeing everything for the first time with their own eyes? The nature of flesh and bone is inherently self-destructive, never changing. Machines could not even fathom that notion. They terminated soon after. Do I get like a a a death story of what happens when you die if I die to a boss? Hmm. Don't tell me I. No, no, no. Mhm. Mm Attendant. Ah, should I shouldn't ah liability to left feet negative one confidence fuck she won't be able to clean things up professionally I just fire her or do I not have enough money no I have the money I'm gonna see if it costs uh to get fired no only twenty five dollars. No, not delivery boy. Oh, I well, his confidence at least is two. Sixth finger. Uh no wait, um Let's look at his health. I, I don't fucking know, man. Hmm. I don't know, I don't like his skills though. Why can't I be the dog or the other person? Hmm. Fuck it, I'll try again anyways. I'll do another dungeon. Alright, so I've never <laughs> I've never been to this one. This would be probably interesting. Something stares back at you from the floor. What? It lurks below. Huh. Pretty cool. Let's see how powerful the ticket attacks are. Not as good as the guard, obviously. I would just need a lot more bullets. Wait, hey, you're not allowed to eat pizza. Nice. I'm not allowed to run though, that's the only problem I guess with this. Very slow. So as long as this I guess this character you could say is a self-defensive character. But all characters' primary attacks suck balls. A larger aspect manifests. So basically like always do zero rat style. It does decent damage. Hmm. Eat this. Hmm. 
Well, perhaps it's like if if I have tons of pizza on me, perhaps the delivery kit is fine. Well, there's a lot of enemies. Oh shit! And they can move. Uh, what? Uh, Alrighty then. Oh my. Okay. Weird. Oh, nice. Oh, partner. Yes. All right, now we can probably take on the boss. What? Elf, agile motherfucker, huh? All right. Pearl sewer rat style. Hmm. Easy. I guess it's gonna be an anime that'll pull me in. Huh? Shit. Consider me surprised. Alright, time to try the boss. Shouldn't be able to win unless just its attacks are. I don't know, unheard of. Who knows? Oh. A kid who died in here? You've disturbed the remains. Ooh. The monster surrounds you. What's all these goddamn monsters? It's gotta be like... Ah, uh, I don't have the camera flash too, which doesn't fucking help. Eh, fuck it. Let's just get rid of... These two. Fuck. Oh. Beautiful, all right. Drain touch. Hmm, this guy's kind of annoying. Oh, wait. What was that? It was literally your stomach contents towards multiple targets. I should have done that probably before then. Didn't know it was uh, multiple targets. Nah, motherfucker. Seriously, he's just constantly healing himself again. That's irritating. Had to outperform damage. Mm. I guess I just had to keep trying to entangle him so he doesn't have annoying moves. Nice. 11 damage. Ah, this guy's regenerative bullshit, though, seriously. Nice. Ooh, yeah. There we go. And I get a folding chair. But the remains destroyed of a fell silence pervades through the playground as the balls slip into an unfamiliar stillness. Upon searching the pit, you find no further evidence of its previous occupant. Nor do you find any of the rumored lost items. Perhaps it is better to leave things as they are, as nothing remains stuck in this place. What about the falling chair? Oh, there it is. How the fuck would it go anyways? I have no idea. All I know is, like, what I need is... The cheesy bar. Two of them. Fuck it. Um... Yes? But yeah, I guess I'll just leave it here, though. 
But I hope you enjoyed this episode. Look forward to more when I actually defeat more bosses and get further into the game. I'm just a little fucking tired, and I gotta, of course, figure out how to fucking uh, get this video edited and recorded properly because all the templates I had, audio wise and editing wise, are just all gone. I mean, I could get it, but that mean lugging my old PC in here and plugging into a monitor, that's just a pain in the ass. I'd rather just retweak and stress over that for a while. So, I hope you enjoyed this episode. And if you did, please leave a like, comment, hit that subscribe button, become a full subscriber, and the notification down below for updates of my videos. Thank you for watching. Until next time. Bye.